Welcome back. This is Lesson 3, Creating Web Pages with Office. In this lesson, you'll learn how to save a Word document as a web page, connect documents using hyperlinks, use a web page template, and convert a presentation for use on the World Wide Web. The website for the Ivy Lodge could be compared to a sort of 24-hour electronic ad. More and more of our potential clients are finding us on the Internet. It's great for business, and creating pages for the Internet has never been easier. Earlier, we created a promotional flyer in Word. Although it is currently a Word document, we can save it to a format that can be placed on our website on the Internet. Documents on the Internet are created using Hypertext Markup Language, or HTML for short. Creating a web page used to mean entering all types of cryptic commands and codes. Getting your information on the Internet took either a lot of training or a hired professional. Now with Office 97, we can just select the Save to HTML command, and our Word document is instantly converted to a web page. First, we'll open the File menu and choose the Save as HTML command. We'll use the Create New Folder button to make a separate folder to keep our web documents in. When we click it, we're prompted for a name. We'll name it Web Stuff. We type its name and press Enter to accept it. Now that our folder is created, we'll save our web page in it. We open the folder by double-clicking on it. When we click on Save, Word processes the flyer and saves it as a web page. Converting this flyer to a web page was easy. However, that's not all we can do with Word's web tools. We'll take a break here. I have to go check on my bread pudding in the oven. And while I do that, why don't you practice converting Word documents to web pages? <laughs> 